What's up, Joe from Joe's Gold Garage? Riding today shotgun with my main pooch, Annie. What's up? She'll lick me to death, so I can't get her attention too much. I uh, just thought I'd do a little quick uh, LS430 update and drive. Not a lot has changed. Uh, the car has actually been sitting in the driveway. Um, it's got 90,483. Um, and I think the last video I did is of it turning over 90,000 miles. So, uh, I think it's been to Chattanooga, Tennessee and back. But other than that, not much. Still needs an oil change. <laughs> Still needs an oil change. Still needs brake rotors. Still needs a timing belt. But, um... Me and Annie are riding to go get us a Starbucks. Isn't that right, Annie? We gonna get a Starbucks? Yeah, we gonna go get a Starbucks. Friday night, <coughs> living the single life. Nothing but me and a dog. My folks are in Mexico for two weeks, so they ask me to keep the dog. In exchange, I get to drive this car for two weeks. So, I may, uh, I've been walking around with a $10 off, uh, Jiffy Lube coupon. I may go some, uh, go by there and, uh, get the oil changed at least. Um, anyway, I guess if you saw my last video, sold the Nissan Quest, made about a thousand bucks on it, right around. Uh, still do not have the title on the Civic. Today is February 21st. It is officially 30 days since I bought it at auction. And uh, I may end up having to just take the car back and they have to give me my money back. I don't know why the hell Rick Hendricks can't get their uh, shit together and get me a title to my Honda. Because I have that thing sold four times over. But, oh yeah, and the Volvo XC90 that I bought Tuesday, I got a notification about 30 minutes ago that the title is in. So, you know, Jim Ellis can get their titles uh, to the auction in four days. Yet, uh, Rick Hendricks can't do it in a damn month. Oh, man, I'm mad. I'm never going to buy any of their cars again. But anyway, so it's a lovely day. It warmed up to about 46 degrees, nice and sunny. We have been flooded out here in Georgia. I mean flooded. Our lake up here, just it's you won't be able to see it. It's just out of view, but our lake is at... Uh, like a record level high and the dam they are letting so much water out that the river is pushing over its banks it's it's been a mess it said something like 46 inches of rain in the past year or six months or some shit like that crazy anyway y'all have a great weekend and uh, look for my uh, going to pick up the Volvo video down at the uh, auction. Uh, I'll be doing that probably maybe Monday. We'll see. I hope so. Anyway, oh, there's my Starbucks. Go get me a go get me a latte. Y'all have a great weekend, people. Appreciate you watching. Uh, you know, if you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing. It really helps the channel grow. And, of course, like and all that good stuff. So, uh, y'all have a good day. Have a great weekend. Peace. Finally, a sunny day after all this rain. So, there she is. Everyone likes to see an update from here time to time. Needs a bath. Needs a bath. You always know when one needs a bath when you see the black streaks running down from the door handles and the mirrors. But, yeah.
losing the clear coat on the bumper. That's kind of been happening for the past couple of years. And now the paint's starting to chip away too. Hmm. A few little rock chips. The um, 5,000 mile 1994 Lexus LS400 is back on bringatrailer.com today. It sold last summer. It now has 5,400 miles. I think it sold for $25,000 last summer. Anyway, my mom said, if that car ever comes up for sale or one like it, I want to buy it. <laughs> She's crazy. She still swears her 93 was way better than this car. Which, I don't know where she gets that from. Because <laughs> this car's been perfect. Never had a repair. And I know the 93 she had had lots of power steering issues with that variable power steering. Got some leaves we need to clean out here. Throw them on the driveway. See what our oil situation looks like. Look at that. And it's 3,000 miles overdue. Crazy, huh? You can go about 7,500, I think, on this. 3,000 mile oil changes is a bit overkill. Oh. That's not as high as it used to be. I hit my freaking head. Oh, I got some acorns. Always like butter. Always. That's the best sound in the world, isn't it? The good old 4.3 V8. Just so smooth. Just the slightest vibration. Can't beat it. Can't beat it. Ninety thousand four ninety. Doing pretty good.